In this series of videos, we are going to look at how to create machine learning apps using Django. So this is what we are going to build. I've taken this problem from Kaggle and I've, I have my Kaggle notebook, which you can see from here where I have my machine learning code. So in this app, what we are going to do is we are going to render our pandas data frame, which is our data set onto a Django app. Then we are going to choose an algorithm with which we want to train our data set. So we are going to use logistic regression and XGBoost. After, once the model is trained, we are going to save the model uh, using Pickle. And once we have saved the models, we can download the predictions using again those two algorithms which we have trained. And once we have done that, we can check how good our, uh, our model is and we'll check the accuracy and the F1, square, F1 score. Right. So this is what we are going to build. It will be it will be a series of video, videos uh, which you which you have to follow. All right. Uh, I have my I have the entire code on my GitHub. You can go ahead, go ahead and take a look at it. I also uh, will be writing articles for this particular series of videos. So if you guys are into articles instead of videos, you can go ahead and look at it on our website. So this is our website. So I'll publish the articles here and you can go ahead and take a look at it. All right. So uh, before we start uh, the series of videos, uh, a couple of things that you need to understand would be, uh, you know how Django works. You have knowledge about creating machine learning models. That would be a plus point. And the other would be you are familiar with HTML, CSS, and Bootstrap. So as we are going to use all these three in building this uh, app, web app, you, it will be it will be a, it will be much easier okay so uh, I'll give you a, a quick background on how my folder structure is and from the next video we can start at uh, we can look at how to render the pandas data frame onto our web app all right so I have my uh, work setup set here which uh, I have a project a Django project which is the churn called as churn and then I have a Django app which is called as telecom Right, since we are working on telecom join predictions so you can create multiple apps into this into this join prediction so in this case we have only one app so that is the telecom next what we have is a templates folder in this we have the index.html which is this what you're looking at all right great and i've used uh environment and i've called it a uh, tele environment in which i've also uh, downloaded all my libraries all right so if you don't know how to set this up uh, you can clone my github and get this working on your system as well all right so from the next video we could look at how to uh, render the pandas data frame onto our web app see you in the next video